Hey guys, today I am going to show you how you can optimize your network for the lowest latency and lowest input lag. This guide will help you to reduce your ping in all online games and also help you to increase your overall browsing experience. If you have high ping, it will also affect your FPS in games. This will also help you to increase your download speeds. If you are new to the channel, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel for more amazing videos like this. Let's aim for 50 likes on this video. So let's get started without any further delay. So first, click on the Windows key and open settings. Then click on Network and Internet. Scroll down and click on Network Reset. Then click on Reset Now. Click on Yes. Then after 5 minutes your PC would be restarted and all of the network adapters will be reinstalled. So for the next step, you need to update your network drivers. If you have Realtek drivers, then you should go on this website, or if your driver brand is something other, then you can search on Google about your drivers. I will provide the link of this website in the description of this video. So once you are here on the website, scroll down and then click on the Windows 10 Auto Installation Program. If you have Windows 10, or you can look down if you have some other version of Windows. Then click on Download File. Then here, you need to solve this CAPTCHA to download the file. Once this gets downloaded right click on it, and then simply extract it. Then double click on this exe file. If you have outdated version of drivers, it should automatically start the update for you. But if you have latest version of drivers, you will see this screen. If you see this screen, just click on repair and then click on next. Then it will automatically fix any error or problem with your drivers. So for the next step, you need to download TCP optimizer for which the link is provided in the description. So once you have downloaded, move it to your desktop, and then right-click on it, and run it as administrator. Now wait for it to fully load the settings. So once the settings are loaded, you will need to follow me here carefully. Here, select Custom Settings. Set this bar to the highest. Then just follow all of the settings which I am doing here, and make sure it matches yours. So once you have all of the settings like mine, click on Apply Changes. And then click on OK. After that, it will ask you to reboot your system, so select No. So next we will go to Advanced Settings. And here, follow all the things which I am doing.
So once you have done all of the settings, click on Apply Changes. And then click on OK. Then it will again ask you to reboot your system, select No. And then you can exit out of this program. So for the next step, go into your Windows search box and type, View Network Connections. Then click on the first option. Then right click on your network adapter and go to its properties. Click on configure. And then go to power management. Untick this option. And then click on OK. Then you can exit out of this. So for the next step, click on your Windows key and go to Settings. Then here, click on Update and Security. Then go to Delivery Optimization. Make sure that is option this set to off position, then go to advanced options. Scroll down and then select this option. Then put a tick mark on these two options. Set this both bars to the minimum which is 5%. Then put a tick mark on these two options also. And set the first bar to the minimum. Then you can exit out of the settings. For the next step, click on your Windows key and then search for CMD. Then open it as an administrator. Then enter all of these commands which I show you step by step. It will ask you to restart your computer at the last, in order to complete with the reset, so close the CMD, and then restart your computer. So guys that's all for today's video, let me know in the comment section, if it did help you, or if you have any questions or quick